This is by far my favorite chapter of the book, and one that I felt closely related to. Let's start with a scenario to more easily understand it, just like the book does. Meet John. John has an idea that thinks it's unique. He's motivated, and the more he thinks about it, the more inspired he gets and feels like working on it. John's working process looks like this. Emotional inspiration, motivation, desirable action. This is fine, but what happens when you're neither inspired nor motivated? <laughs> looks like you're screwed. Manson's do something principle states that you should take action even if you are not motivated. Your actions will motivate and inspire you to keep going. By doing even the most minuscule action, you'll get hyped and will find it easier to continue. Therefore, John's working process should be action, inspiration, motivation. Remember that we are all great thinkers, but only a handful are good executioners. 